Hey guys, welcome back to Living with JNL. Uh, we're here at Copperfield Bowls, uh, my home bowling center. And uh, here's V. Lara Kurt. Why are we always filming? I'm like, I brought snacks. If you want snacks, we have saltines, Lara Bars. You know, not sponsored, but let's see, we got Lara Bar. I brought lots of snacks. I'm the snack bag. So what are we doing today? Are we, are we, are we bowling or like what's going on? So today we are actually going to be doing a spare ball competition. Um, got a little uh, surprise in store for y'all. You know, make sure to stick around so you can see. Um, we're going to be bowling a game um, with with our new spare balls. Um, and yeah, they, they look awesome. So y'all should stick around and, you know, check them out. Thanks for sticking around. Um, about to see these spare balls. Um, why, why, you know, why are they so special? Well, you know, I think there were only 120 made. I mean, there are definitely more being made right now, but there were only 120 made at first, and they sold out in five days. So, uh, uh, it is these beauties. It is a striking against breast cancer spare ball. Um, definitely one of a kind spare ball for sure. I mean, 120 made, sold out in five days. And uh, Carol Norman's Pro Shop, on my shirt, here in Houston, Texas, sells these. And currently, the Striking Against Breast Cancer Foundation is trying to form a website so you can directly purchase these balls. Um, but yeah, all the money made from these boy balls goes to Strike Against Breast, breast Cancer. What a great charity. Helps fight breast cancer and everything. Having a, um, striking out against breast cancer makes doubles actually here in this house, um, in July and August, around the end of July. So, it'll be exciting and we hope to showcase these balls very well today. I don't know how many pins I can knock down on the first ball, but hopefully I can pick them all up on the second one. So, what about you? Yeah, I mean, this, these balls look amazing going down the lane. Um, you know, there's not much, you know, not much more that needs to be said. They're clear, has a, you know, bright pink weight block in it. Um, yeah, so let's get some bowling in and uh, see who comes out on top. Okay, so the honorary first ball goes to Julian. So, all right, Julian, don't um, plop it in the gutter or pocket a 10, which I may likely do, so. We'll see how's his rolls. Let's find out right now. Okay, so oh, yeah. so Julian's ball was ace cash money, as we say now. Uh, I don't know how he does it, but mine does not look as strobe lighty as his does. But let's see how my first shot goes. <laughs> All right, uh, so I threw it fast. Uh, it just didn't uh, go anywhere. So obviously because it's a spare ball, which is a good thing because it goes straight. I just don't have a lot of revs like Julian. So anything to say? What, what should I do, coach? What, what's my next move? You just got to move right pocket rocket. Okay, so... I'm gonna pick it up. I mean, it has a bucket in there, a little, little pin hiding behind there. So we'll see if I can pick it up with a spare ball. As long as I throw it hard, I should be able to. And we'll fast forward you through the game, show you guys a couple shots and keep you guys updated on, on how our game goes. All right. Oh, my God. 
would love to show you the score, but we barely got the camera to prop up right, so we don't want to move it. Um, but I mean, <laughs> for me, I did not pick up that bucket thing, that five count. I got four, just didn't hit the five pin. But other than that, I have four in a row now, thanks to Coach Julian. And Julian, tell him, what, tell him what's going on. Man, I got the front five. The slight flexing. This spare ball is walled. Yeah, as long as you just uh, throw it at the head pin really hard and fast. I mean, Julian does that pretty normally anyways. <laughs> but I mean, that spare ball is money, so. Half game recap and half game to go. 10th frame, we'll keep you guys updated. Guys, I actually have to pick up a spare now with a spare ball. Julian's still flexing on him. It's all good. All right, so this is actually what the spare ball is used for. So no pressure on this 3610, right? Not gonna lie, uh, it was a close one, but I made it. So let's keep going. Okay, so um, I apparently. Uh, this is meant to be for a spare ball for me. I had a good run while it was good. Julian's still running. I mean, he's sprinting with the spare ball. So I'm gonna shoot the seven pin and show you what this spare ball does. and then transfer it over to Julian because at this point, don't worry about my game. Ah. <clears throat> yeah, we're not going to talk about my game, ladies and gentlemen. But let's shift the over focus, focus over to Mr. Julian. All right, All right guys. Front 11 right here. You just need one more, man. One more. Come on. All right, one more for all the marbles. Can he do it? No pressure. Oh, give me some of that. Are you on aisle seven? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh. Got a clean 299. Oh my god. Oh. oh my goodness. All right, recap, Julian. Man. I mean, what do you have to say to that? After all those strikes with a spare ball, a plastic ball, I quit bowling. <laughs> <laughs> well, that man said it for you, Julian. <laughs> said it all for you. So, man, what a game. What a game. All right, I don't know what you can see, but I'm going to shoot the spare and then. We'll go to a recap and see you guys soon. Alrighty. You do? 
those are cool. Those are nice. Yeah, it's the breast cancer uh, spare ball. I gotta get one of these. Oh yeah. yeah. I mean, he just shot two ninety nine with it, so just the spare ball. <laughs> yeah. You're the man, Julian. You're the man. And you're the woman, Lauren. Thank, thank you. I appreciate Those it. Those are nice. I love thank them. Thank you. Thank you. I know they're amazing. Hopefully they'll sell some during the tournament. I'll have to buy one. Just put it on my man. Uh, yeah, yeah, they actually um, sold 120 in five days. But oh, they're, I remember that. Yeah. yeah. But now yeah. they're making more. So. Oh, nice. Yeah. Now I'll have to get one. Yeah, yeah. for sure. content in there. Yeah. All right, everybody, this is Keith. He was really nice and he gave us some tips of tricks of life and he really loved the spare ball. So this is the voice behind all that good stuff he said. So. Yes, the, the story about men getting <laughs> stupid. I'm almost 60 years old and my wife's favorite word is wow. Not because she's amazed, but just because I have reached a new depth of stupidity. <laughs> Hence, why we marry women. But yes, the new Storm Ball, it is awesome. It looks great. It's a great going ball. Julian just shot 299 with a spare ball. Get this ball. Thank you, thank you. The table of thoughts. Tell me, Julian, how was it? Man, that, that I, I had it, man. That last shot was... That was a microphone. Anyways, continue. It's okay, we'll I always do that. Okay. We'll <laughs> Alright, uh, number, take number a thousand. Okay, so, <clears throat> tell us about your reaction to the spare ball. Or strike ball. Yeah, apparently, you know, it's got more than one, uh, you know, characteristic. It's not just a spare ball, apparently. So, um, yeah, I mean, I shot 299, she just shot 235. Um, I mean, I don't really know what else to say. I mean, it was, it was pretty cool. Even uh, if you don't want to get a new spare ball, you just want to strike a lot. Actually, this is a pretty powerful spare ball. So, I mean, even if you shoot spares at, you know, 10 pin, it'll bounce out. I mean, this this is a one of a kind ball for sure. I mean, just the power hits the pin. So, don't forget, um, more is coming. More is being produced. So. Keep on a lookout, and um, it's open to the public. Anyone want to pre-order it? Again, it's sold at You Can Bowl 2, Carol Norman's Pro Shop. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I hope you really guys enjoyed all this extra content that we actually got tonight. You know, this extra feedback, and, you oh, yeah. know, it was uh, it was amazing. And I actually had pretty fun. It was pretty fun, so. Oh, yeah. I mean, I was like expecting you know yeah it's gonna be close you know <laughs> we're gonna be shooting at a bunch of 10 pins yeah you know we're gonna be shooting 180 190 the whole time i thought i was gonna 810 and then no she shoots 235 and then i, I don't know I, I guess just happened how it happened so i guess this is what doing the sport you love feels like i mean this was exhilarating i mean this was so fun just unbelievable for a great cause too and you know even though he didn't shoot a 300 299 it's pretty darn tuned good oh, yeah. all right so thank you guys for tuning into our vlog also have our merch sale going on until next tuesday so don't miss out on that and don't miss out on the spare ball so yeah um i don't know what's going on down there but you know lots of good things happening tonight so uh see you guys later stay tuned for our next video merch all that good stuff. Thanks for keeping up with us in this crazy life of Julian and Lara. So, what's your outro? Thank you guys for watching. Um, you know, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Um, you know, these, again, these balls are just, you know, one of a kind. Um, and yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed and we'll see y'all in the next video. Will we say that? Peace. Thank you. Thank, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. All right, now we say good night and great bowling and peace.